Libra Singles. Welcome, David Sky Tarot. This is going to be your singles read for the second half of January 2022. It's four card reading. What we see up here is the bottom of the deck, and it's the Ten of Cups. So, you know, I, I thank you, Spirit. I, I honestly want to say when the readings are this clear, it's been hard lately for me. It's uh, It seems to me, I, somebody comment, I have a lot of spiritual friends. It's like the veil is thick. You know, normally it's thin. Normally I hear things. And, uh, it's Now I have to use my mind. Since Mercury retrograde, it's like really gotten bad. It's like molasses, you know. So I really have to kind of use my mind, like back to, it's like going, I have to go back to like a pen and a paper after, you know, working, uh, you know, with a computer or something. So uh, you're coming in with this nine of pentacles here. It's, you're really high functioning. You've got to wherever you need to go. You can take care of yourself, you're self-fulfilled and everything like that. And, you know, the logical next step, you get your ten of pentacles and that's a lock. I mean, pretty much as good as it gets but I think with this overall energy of the ten of cups and look at how sweet that is and even the family could be you know if you're a younger Libra so you know it's okay kids I love relationship channels so this is all about you here your energy and around love relationships and I pinnacles great energy to be in this one everyone in the world says and I'm no reason to disagree uh, is when you're going to find your love because you, you're self-fulfilled, you take care of yourself, focus on yourself. But I see the Ten of Cups up here with this. You could be a manifester. That's what hit me when I saw that because I like to think there's a lot of spiritual manifestors watching, you know. Someone with the Nine of Pentacles consciously manifesting love from a position of strength, you know, you think a lot of Libra archetypical energy, it's the other, it's the diplomat, it's compromise, it's putting the self second. Uh, and so you, you don't associate it with strength, but, you know, there's a lot of strength and you know, Libras communicate that energy too, that air, uh, a cardinal air, very directed, it can communicate very well. Um, so, this is an energy, uh, it, when you consider this it, together, to me, it's like you're just manifesting. And then, <clears throat> manifesting or not, what's blocking you is the hermit reverse. So, you know you're ready to kind of come out uh, from some kind of uh, seclusion. You just get the COVID thing all over. It ain't to go there, but, uh, but you know, <clears throat> you're kind of delaying it. What's interesting, now this is blocking you though, so but so when you get the hanged man here, I really think this is the advice from spirit, I think the most important card in this four card read, and, the, and so, but here I think it's looking at things from a different perspective, because the, her, hang, the hermit reverse could be looking at it from a different perspective. To me, it's like you've been too long doing the hermit's work, which is great work. You know, I said it's great energy to be in Nine of Pentacles. We didn't get there by accident because this doesn't necessarily mean you're wealthy, but it means you've done this, you're solid, you're grounded, self-contained, you know, you've done the emotional work of self here with this uh, hermit energy. But it's maybe, there's a time, it's like, um, there's a time when theory, you have to leave theory and you have to move into reality if you want to manifest, you know, this great love. This is your great love here, Libra. So, uh, you know, this you could be someone who it hasn't been buying into the need of a great love or the draw of a great love. And, and now you're kind of feeling it. You're feeling like, wow, like I, I really think I need that to really have my Ten of Pentacles. I need this cup in my life, this love in my life, motions. So you need to look at this from a different perspective here. And that's what I want to get a, uh, what I want to get a clarifier on, two of pinnacles. So it's kind of clarifying the hermit and the hangman. Let's go together. You got a bit, I, I put the hermit reverse because that's in the blocking position here. So it's kind of like an advice, too. This is your advice. 
I think it's advice you got to realize that uh, you're hanging yourself up, right? This is the stay or go two of wands, take action. Here it's kind of contemplative here. The ethereal visions illuminated tarot. You know, the normal one, he's on the trail. He's got a little backpack. He's ready to rock, you know, and it's kind of beautiful. He's kind of dreamy, so uh, it's like the universe is telling you at least get your uh, kind of head into the game and prepare to kind of let go of this energy of sort of harmony and introspection and to take action here on what you want. You know, the three of wands that becomes, you know, looking for your ships to come in. Uh, so this is uh, preparing you to take action, to kind of fire up here. Um, there, it seems to be an indication of some time, you know, with the hangman too. So this may not, I know this is kind of the end of January, I'd say, uh, read for singles. Um, uh, but, you know, maybe it's February. A lot of February is going to really, when everything moves forward for a little bit, it's like, if you haven't got the oomph by then, I think, uh, God help us, we'll all be getting it. But this guy's is your outcome. And I, okay, first of all, this is what I call in the Ethereal Vision Illuminated Tarot, the uh, Jim Morrison King of Cups. Does that kind of look like Jim Morrison from the doors? Am I crazy? What's this guy, Matt Hughes, uh, drew this uh, deck? Maybe he's a doors fan. You know, it's got a little bit, too, of the dude uh, from the Great Lebowski, uh, a real icon of mine. But you notice, too, it has the Pisces, right? It has a fish necklace. I don't know. So I read a lot with this, though, Cancer Energy. But So this is your person showing up. This is your king, uh, male or female. That's not it. Either way here. Uh, but uh, water sign, so, you know, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. And uh, someone uh, that meets you very well, your Nine of Pentacles. So uh, this means you're manifesting very clearly. You just got to kind of step into it. It's sort of the universe sort of saying like the ball's in your court here. Libra, all you got to do is like the journey of a thousand miles starts with a single step. All you got to do is light the candle. All you got to do is throw the bushel basket off your candle and just let your light shine um, like you're right there, right? And then I think you can kind of rest assured that this personality is going to show up. And you got to understand, this is the coolest king in uh, the, any deck, man. Look, look how laid back that king is. I mean, lucky bastard. It's going to be, you know, check dude, you know. It's a general read. But either way, you know, maybe, maybe they're... Like they got their shit together, and they're mature, and they're emotionally mature, and responsible, and open, and intelligent. Uh, but at the same time, you know, they're laid back. Like they're not controlling, they're not, because uh, look at the way he's dressed. There's none of that kind of stuff with the King of Cups with this one. This one's really laid back. It's got his, like, uh, probably like a white Russian there. So I think it's the dude from the Great Lebowski. But they're pretty chill. So I think this is what you could look forward to. And here's what I'd like to say, Libra. They're bringing in here cups, uh, lot, lots of love. You want a ten of cups, you got a king of cups. That's a good job. <laughs> good job. And maybe that's exactly what you want in your life. You want more emotional uh, tenderness and love. Hey, right on. <laughs> that's all I can say. Right on. So thank you guys. I love it. I think it just really shows you like you're right on. I mean, uh, just go ahead and, and make the leap, pull the trigger, uh, whatever that means to you uh, here, Lever. So thank you guys. Give me a like. Appreciate it. Kind of helps a little algorithm move it along, which I'd like to do. Get it out to more people here. Try to kick up with more readings as we go along. Do give me a, a follow here if you haven't and subscribe and Hit the bell. Thank you, guys.